hello everyone in this video we are going to talk about trailer profile how you can add a new trailer or how you can edit the profile of an existing trailer for that we'll go to master entry trailer option to add a new trailer we have to click on add trailer and enter the unit number plate number country year and all this information make sure you enter the correct unit number as once it is entered we cannot edit it later on for example, if I try to edit the unit number of this trailer, I'm not able to. You can edit everything else, but not the unit number. Then we have the monthly reduction options, where you can add fixed amount monthly occurring expenses, like insurance and ELD charges, or in the case of trailer, you can also enter the tracking device charges. If you want to enter parking charges, we have to enter the name of the expense here, and then the total charges over here. These charges have to be inclusive of all GST, HST, all kind of taxes. And then you have to enter the valid till date. Till what date do you want the software to generate these entries automatically? And then enter the vendor. Whom are you paying to for these expenses? And then we have to check this HST option. Once you save this entry, software create these entries every month and you will not have to create them again and again. Over here, you can also enter the safety details. For example, annual inspection. So you can enter the name of the safety and when is it expiring. 30 days before the expiry, software will start giving you reminders. If you check this option, stop dispatch on expiry, you will not be able to dispatch this trailer once the safety is expired. But if this option is unchecked, it means that you will be able to assign dispatch to this trailer, but every time that you'll assign it, software will send you the reminder. If you have any questions regarding this, you can always call our office line 905-624-5959, extension 1. Thank you.